Hey, everybody, we're going to go ahead and get started. We're going to now explore using our DSO with a low amp clamp. We're going to start off with some single uh, uh, patterns, and then we're going to get into uh, the dual patterns on my next video. So let's get started. All right, here we go. Uh, we're going to start off, like I said before, we're going to get into some low amp clamp um, or pro uh, that we can actually use to actually do a little more exploring on electrical patterns. This is going to help you a lot when you're trying to figure out some strange things going on. Everything from an ignition pattern all the way to uh, like even a, a fuel pump, uh, actually the way that is set up too. So you can actually see this is a typical uh, primary ignition pattern. Uh, this, you know, basically is showing a, a really good one that we have right here. So this is going to show you that magnetic field as it collapses and then the voltage is induced. And you're going to see that spike going on. Uh, this is a another uh, ignition coil pattern. Uh, this is a primary side, and it's showing the saturation part of the actual where it toggles the voltage. And this is a normal type pattern also. This is kind of unique to Ford. This is the multi-strike uh, pattern that they have. And this uh, is, you know, kind of keep this in mind because when we get into some uh, poor looking ones i want to get closer into showing you some bad patterns this is what you're going to want to see too so this is an actual current you know goes up from, from zero amps up to five amps which is you know the, the vertical part of it like that so keep that in mind and this is a typical um you know typical type of ford uh v10 uh ignition pattern and showing all the coils and then over here we actually have a fuel pump i'm sorry a fuel injector primary on it and you can see how it actually goes up uh this is showing uh a one amp you know and then also in going in about three milliseconds of time This is another typical low, but this is a limiting current uh, type of injector. Uh, this you'll see, and this is where some people uh, actually misdiagnosis. They see that chop top on it, and they go, oh, this has got to be bad because I'm used to the other ones. So keep that in mind when you're looking at and you see some strange patterns. Then you may have to do some exploring to see if it's an actual limiting current flow on it. This is a fuel, some fuel injectors. You know, these are current uh, ramping, uh, current ramp uh, for you know, fuel injectors going on here. So you can actually see with the firing pattern on there. Hey, everybody. Uh, if you like this video, please like and subscribe. That helps me out and I can make more videos with your support. So until next time, I'll talk to you soon. Bye for now.